Jackson season Super Bowl was absolutely insane. We dropped the 40 bomb. And this year in Wheel of Mutt, I have a new rule. If I ever score 40 points or more, I can open a Panini Immaculate box. I can add one player from the opening to my team and I can give away every card. There's just one problem. I am in Oahu and I do not have a Panini Immaculate box. I was just gonna ignore it for this Wheel of Mutt, but I have one Hail Mary option. There is a card shop on the island. I'm headed there right now. We just gotta hope that they have a Panini Immaculate box. Remember when I said it was a Hail Mary? Apparently it's right there. Don't judge a book by its cover. Hey y'all. How's it going, you guys still open? Yeah. Cool. Hey, uh, I called earlier. I was looking for the um, collegiate, I think it was collegiate uh, immaculate. Is this 2023? <laughs> Yo, oh my God. Bag secured. All right, so usually on the channel, I'm opening the collegiate immaculate, which are actually a little less expensive than this. This is 2023 NFL impeccable. Uh, the greatest sports card pull I ever made was like three years ago. I got a silver bar Tom Brady, just a fucking insane card. This has a chance to have one of those. These are eight in this. This cost me $1,500, which is a little bit of an upcharge, but um, obviously I didn't have a choice. No backup boxes, so if I drop another 40 bomb, this may literally be the only Panini Impeccable or Immaculate on the entire island, but I got it. Hey, let's get after this episode. I'll see you guys up there. Look at this beauty, man, in all her glory. I haven't opened an NFL in impeccable in a long time but this is a brand new season of wheel of mutt so let's do our wheel of mutt things first let's talk about the brand new squad let's get all that figured out and then i'm gonna open impeccable we'll get going on this episode so first things first it is a season opener meeting we've got a lot of silver players to worry about you're wondering who the prestige player is you look at offense and you see absolutely nobody new in fact you see something more than that so we have our prestige trent williams we have our prestige jamar chase zach Kuntz is my starting tight end because I will be using middle linebacker Rob Gronkowski for this season. I, I just forgot how good he was. Uh, I love tight end Gronk. We've had many amazing seasons with him, but honestly, I'm kind of excited to go get a new tight end one. I think we're finally at the point where I can switch it up. And honestly, tight end Gronk is a little outdated. Vanguard's still amazing, but he's outdated, whereas middle linebacker Gronk is still absurdly good. No matter how many good cards come out, he will always be six foot six with free lurk artist and avalanche. Now, no gigantic shocker here, but my prestige player was PS2, Patrick Sertan. This card is so good. He has deep zone KO for one AP, broken ability, you get free pick artist, and he's actually boosted to a 98 overall. He's got 99 man, 94 zone, 99 press. I keep mixing up pursuit and press. Regardless, this team badly needed a prestige corner. There's always at least two corners on the field and usually three in nickel sets. It's shocking it took me this long to prestige a corner, but I got an amazing one. This is an end game corner, and he gets to be there with my end game, Derwin James, Ray Lewis, Rob Gronkowski, Nick Bosa, and... I literally, I almost forgot about this until I just saw him. I'm a fortune teller. They talked all that shit. They talked all that shit about the Jalen Carter prestige. Guess what? Last season, we had Will Anderson anyway. And this season, we got an updated Jalen Carter. So the prestige Jalen Carter now pays off as well. Christmas Jalen Carter was insane. The 93 overall with free inside stuff was nasty. Or sorry, one AP inside stuff. This Jalen Carter has plus four in every stat, one AP inside stuff, and the kicker, zero AP in interior threat. Interior threat is edge threat, but for D tackles, dominant pass rush moves from the interior for free. So even if they're not running an inside zone play, he's going to get better pass rush moves on average. Dude, this card is so good. The next thing I'd like to do before this impeccable box is determine my team for this season. So last season, we were the Houston Texans. That determines our jerseys, our playbooks, and a team captain. So last season's team captain was Will Anderson. We'll spin the team wheel right now, and this will determine our our team for the entire season. At this point, I really don't care who we land on. I just gotta hope that their playbook is good. Please, please. <laughs> oh, could you ask for anything more? The Detroit Lions. All right, boys, we are suited. Lions, classic home and classic away. I had the alternate jerseys, so that's awesome. We got the home stadium. We got Motor City, Dan Campbell. We've got Lions offense and Lions defense. I do have a good amount of practice with both of these playbooks. Not gonna lie, neither are very good, but there have been a lot of times that I just use these base playbooks because the Lions are my favorite team. So I have practice, but I'm not gonna pretend like these are very good playbooks. Now, oh, dude, 
Like there's a limited Brian Branch egg though. That would low key be sick. Are you kidding me? What a perfect time to move Gronk to middle linebacker. Sam Laporta, not gonna lie, as far as Madden is concerned, this is a very short tight end. A six foot three tight end is basically a wide receiver. But damn, he's a stud. 95 speed, excellent route running across the board. I gotta say for a 97 overall, he does not have like any stats that are 97. I feel like this kind of should be a 96 overall. How is this a 97? He's like 197 stat. I'm not gonna talk shit about my boy, Sam Laporta. 97 overall, Sam Laporta, the incredible rookie tight end, is going to be our team captain for Lions season. I'm gonna go double me. Gosh, I'm gonna miss Vanguard. Let's see what discounted abilities he gets. Tight end apprentice, matchup nightmare, mid out elite. Okay, tight end apprentice will be really important if we don't get a hot route master quarterback. For now, I'm gonna run matchup nightmare and he gets deep elite for one. Oh my God, that's how you balance this card. Now the first episode is always fun because you get to do a lot of team building, especially when you drop a 40 bomb in the Super Bowl. Let's crack this thing open. Okay, the seal is accurate. This thing is untouched. I can add one player from this box to my team. And of course, I'll be giving away all eight cards that we pull, unless I pull a lion. I'm keeping it. Holy shit, holy shit. First card of the opening. Rookie, Devon Achen. 61 of 75. And by the way, if you've got a problem with my Devon Achan pronunciation, you, unfortunately, are a casual. I have done extensive research. His name is pronounced Devon Achan. Impeccable number two? Dude! I'm not gonna lie, man. If I'm gonna get a Justin Jefferson, kinda hoping that one's gonna be an auto or a patch, but still, 38 of 75, a base Justin Jefferson, 38 of 75. Honestly, such a good card, but he doesn't have shit in Madden this year. I'm surprised he doesn't have a better card. There's not a lot of good options for him. Interesting one here. Antonio Gibson. I do think Devon Achan has a weekly wild card, like a 95 or 96 overall. So he is my best option for the Madden Ultimate Team right now. Uh, any Commanders fans out there, got Antonio Gibson for you. I'm looking at a card I've never seen in my entire life. Who is that? Yo! <laughs> This is so sick. Yo, it's the raw dog signature too, right on the card. None of that, none of that sign a sticker, peel it off and slap it on bullshit. That thing is raw. No condom, no glizzy, no bev, no condiment. Oh my goodness, a fire starter Terry McLaurin. Sorry, I have Alzheimer's right now. Sorry, I don't know why I said that. 42 of 50, Panini Impeccable, Terry McLaurin. What is this? This is another card I'm not familiar with. I'm gonna let you guys see it first. Yo, is that a legend? 30 of 40. 49, illustrious ink, Tim Brown. I don't think Tim Brown's an ultimate team. Damn, I'm kind of getting railroaded on, you know, some of these players. Wow, these are such cool cards. I know one of you or your dad is a huge Tim Brown fan. That is a really cool card. Oh my God, and he doesn't have a card. Dude, these cards are sick, but I need something for Wheel of Mud. Terrell Davis. Yo, TD, Terrell Davis, 62 of 99. Immense, it's got a piece of the Broncos jersey, the old Broncos jersey, and it's got his signature on there. So we got a patch auto Terrell Davis, 62 of 99. Damn it! <laughs> Honestly, damn it, I need somebody in Madden. Ooh, ooh, we got a Houston Texan, ladies and gentlemen. We got a rookie Houston Texan. Tank. Oh, that is a sick card right there. Tank Dell, 82 of 99, a true rookie. Tank Dell right there. And there is exactly one card left in this opening. It is thick as hell. I don't want to look quite yet. <laughs> Oh my fucking God. Oh my fucking God. Oh my God. One of five helmet, jersey, cleat, Sam Laporta. Holy fuck. There is no way. There's no way. He's the best fuck. Oh my God. No, that's insane. That is insane. Oh my God. Dude, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. For $1,500, this box was not a great box, like in the grand scheme of things, but this just changes everything for me, dude. Oh my God, it's a one of five. This is one of the rarest cards I have. And it's a rookie. It's a rookie Sam Laporta one of five. That's absolutely insane. Well, I, I can't use him for Wheel of Mud either. Got A-Chan, Jettas, Lauren. Sorry, that's actually Gibson. Got the uh, Firestarter McLaurin. So we got two Washington Commanders.
Rodriguez. A juicy little Tim Brown. Terrell Davis action going on. And the boy Tank Dell. Um, and of course, we top it off with... Um, I'm sorry, guys. I'm not giving this away. I, I did... Before that seal came open, I said, if I get a Lions player, I'm keeping it. I'm sorry. You know how badly I want this. Insane opening. Now the question is, who are we adding to the team? I've kind of got to, like, figure out which of these guys actually has good cards first. I feel like I might be forgetting somebody. Tank Dell's got a 93 overall corner. Terry McLaurin doesn't have shit. His best card's an 88 overall. Whoa. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute, Matthew, you casual. I was totally wrong about Justin Jefferson. That's actually an insanely good pull. Justin Jefferson has a competitive pass card. I think I didn't know about this card because number one, I never complete the competitive pass, but two, it probably only recently has been available to be auctioned because some people have to earn it first to auction it. Okay, this is actually an incredible option. He would be wide receiver one. He's definitely better than Jamar. Holy shit. He has 98 speed? This is fucking insane. I'm probably going Justin Jefferson here. I don't really see how I do anything else. Terrell Davis has a 95 overall Super Bowl pass halfback. None of them beat this Justin Jefferson. Ironically, though, if I had opened this first, I could have taken a different Lions player. But I, I kind of wanted Sam Laporta anyway, so it feels like we were going to end with Sam Laporta regardless. And in this scenario, we got Sam Laporta and Justin Jefferson. 97 overall Justin Jefferson with 98 speed. 97 deep. He's six. Yeah, I mean, you guys know how good Justin Jefferson is. I'm excited to use him this year. I have not used him a single time this year. He has deep elite for free. And then he also gets fucking route tech. Oh my god. Route tech deep elite for one. Yeah, we're in the end game, boys. We are definitely in the end game. And you can get third down threat for free? Oh my god. What? Wait, third down threat, route tech, and deep elite for one. Yeah, we're in the end game. Now, next up on the agenda is something exciting. So in the Super Bowl, we also completed our challenge week. Technically, we also got a rage quit, but there was a couple minutes left in the fourth quarter. I'm not going to count that, but I will absolutely take one pack of my choice to kickstart our team since we completed our Super Bowl challenge wheel. Now, Sugar Rush is available. This will give me 289 plus and 184 plus. That's a pretty good option. I'm going to take a whack at Sugar Rush. It would be exciting to hopefully get a quarterback or halfback, but I'm not, not totally sure what's in this promo. Okoronkwo, Jonah Williams, 92 overall. Marquise Goodwin, 92 overall. Our first Sugar Rush player, Chargers wide receiver one, Quentin Johnston. We have a Harvest player, Logan Hall. And our final player, Brandon Stevens. You know what? I can make this work. We have three wide receivers now. We've got Logan Hall across from Nick Bosa. And then Stevens will actually help. I got Silvers back there. I, I'm not mad about this at all. Quentin Johnston, let's toss you in there. On defense, uh, Nesta Jade Silvera is coming out. Sorry, buddy. Back to the bench. Logan Hall is in. And then Carrington Valentine. Oh. Oh God, just thinking about this guy makes me mad. Puts our team at an 82 overall before the very first wheel spin. That's a really, really good way to start a wheel of mutt team. The biggest issue right now is, is quarterback halfback. I have to fill those positions. All right, boys, the very first wheel spin of Detroit Lions season. This season hasn't even started. This might be my favorite season ever. I'm really liking how we're going right now. Oh, this is actually really good, but it's non-limited. The limiteds in AKA crews are disgusting. We can get any AKA crew player that's not a limited. Gotta take a quarterback or halfback here. I have to. So there's an Emmett Smith. There's a Troy Aikman. There's a Marshall Folk. Marshall Folk is not a limited. This Marshawn Lynch is a limited. Darn it, I wanted that Marshawn Lynch. The decision is made, gentlemen. I'm going with the 97 overall Marshall Folk. 97 speed, 98 brick tackle, 98 change direction. He's a receiving back and it looks like he has a baked-in evasive. So he has evasive, a.k.a. Cruz, starts on for six plays, grants steerable spin and juke moves. I'll go human joystick for free, energizer for free. This is a weird card. And backyard halfback. All right, we have one glaring problem solved. That's halfback now. Let's solve our quarterback dilemma, please. Make it possible. This is a really good wheel spin early, but it's just not right now. When I need a quarterback, that is not a good wheel spin because now we are fully reliant on my third wheel spin to guarantee a quarterback. I'm gonna start with Sugar Rush. We'll go one Sugar Rush, one Ultimate Legend, and then I don't know what three is gonna be. We'll find out. Our first Sugar Rush player, Marquise. That's kind of good, but I actually have three wide receivers already. I'm not sure if I'm too geeked up about Ezra Cleveland. That's very nice. And Tyron Matthews is actually also a starter. So I have a silver in that position right now. Tyron Matthews in for 
Brandon Joseph. Ezra Cleveland's going in for a silver as well. It's really just Marquise Goodwin who's not gonna be doing too much. All right, pack number two, we're moving to Ultimate Legends. If I could just pull a quarterback. If you wanna just like let me pull a quarterback, I'd not be mad at all. To that bitch, give me head. He's not even gonna be a starter either. Bruce Smith would go in for Logan Hall. 92 Bruce Smith definitely would go in for Logan Hall. Okay, so we've got a new edge rusher across from Bosa. Kevon Wallace will not get reps. Honestly, AKA Cruz probably has the best chance. If I could pull Aikman or Cunningham. I'm looking for Troy Aikman or Randall Cunningham here. AKA Cruz Pack, Aaron Jones. I guess a backup halfback. Get a Gridiron Guardian. Is Derek Forrest better? Better than Tyran. And our AKA crew player. This is the big dog. I got two Sam Laportas and two Marshall Folks today. That's just, that's just weird, man. It's just weird. All right, let's take Chris Rodriguez out and let's throw in that 88 Aaron Jones. Why not? I still don't have a quarterback. Now, defensively, instead of Tyran Matthew, we can rock Derek Forrest. Take Brandon Joseph out of the backup and put in 84 Tyran Matthew. Throw in Bruce Smith at left end. Are you starting to see the issue? I've only got one wheel spin left. I gotta go. I can't have Tanner McKee starting there. Our wheel spin right here is... Ooh, please let there be a quarterback. Division Dynasty. So I think this has 96 overalls. Let's hope there's a 96 quarterback. That'll make things easy for me. Shaq Barrett, Taron Johnson, Juwan Jennings, Melifonwu, Michael Pierce, Tunsil Tooney. Oh my God, dude. Don't fucking make me put Bryce Young out there. No, don't tell me he's my only option, bro. Don't make me put him out there. <laughs> All right, here are my options, gentlemen. There's a 91 CJ Stroud. There's a 90. Okay, there's literally only one 93 Bryce Young on the auction house. I gotta take it. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. It's temporary. There's no, I shouldn't say there's no way. I've seen crazier things at Wheel of Mud. But 93 Bryce Young is currently your starting quarterback. His stats are okay. I think what's going to determine here is the abilities. He's a scrambler. So I have, I have a feeling he's going to be dog shit. He does have a two AP gunslinger. We got to take that. That's the absolute non-negotiable. He could get protected, which he does not get in real life. <laughs> no hot route master. No hot route master is a big adjustment for me. I'm so used to having hot route master. This is not the prettiest Wheel of Mud team you've ever seen, but it works. Yeah, it's going to be a brutal first game, but I'm really excited, man. And of course, an absurdly important challenge wheel. There's two episodes where it's the most important. That's the Super Bowl and the season opener. And they want me to throw for 350 with Bryce Young. Okay. All Madden regular season, clean slate, 350 plus. Shit, if I get 350 plus, I might be going back for another Panini Immaculate box. Justin Jefferson, Patrick Sertan, and Ray Lewis. Two brand new players on the top three. I'm excited to see Justin Jefferson up there. I'm really excited to use that card. First and 10, honestly, with this insane Jamar Chase, I feel like we just gotta go straight to him right out the gates. Oh, Jefferson's actually, oh, can you make that throw? Bryce Young! Who are you? Oh my God. What a throw on the run. Dude, like right here, I wanna give Justin Jefferson, I wanna give him a corner route so badly, but I can't. That's gotta be open. Oh, he torched him. No, but that's third and 15. That blitz came in hot. This is a different defensive. Dude, Ted Hendricks is not guarding Laporta. This is going. Oh, he's got him. Maybe. Cards! Sam Laporta. He, dude, I think he shaded outside on that too. That was just a crazy play. Ooh, that's coming in hot. I gotta go Laporta. Cut! Joke! I gotta get a Laporta jersey after this, bro. It's gonna be a hell of a season for him. Also, those were all passing yards. So we're off to a good start. Looking at Jamar Chase. Stepping up. Bryce. Oh, shit. That's a QB spy. Okay, I got bodies. Uh, that's what I get for trying to run. That is not open. That ain't even close to open. Oh, it might be because, oh, I'm sitting here thinking that's a horrible throw, but that's a silver, that's Kavon Wallace back there. That's actually a good throw. All right, what do we got? Second and 10. I'm not sure. Boom! <laughs> is that Bruce Smith? Hey! Third and 25. He is in a very scary spot after that huge play from Bruce Smith. Let's guess pass here. See if we can do it again. Throws a sketchy one. This game's over. I can't believe this. The only thing that sucks is I had 64 passing yards of Bryce Young. Like, that was really good. I'm gonna take a little poverty spin here on the Rage Quit wheel, and then we're gonna go hop into a game. So, hold up. Let me, let me spin this first so you guys can see it. 
Okay. I'm not a great spin on the Rage Quit Wheel, but that's okay. I didn't really earn that. That guy's just wasn't that guy was 100 percent rolling a blunt, getting high, trying to play mad at the same time. And um just doesn't work like that. You gotta get high first, then get on the game. Don't try and you're not fucking you're not Tony Stark, buddy. Low-key a nasty option. So 91 Dre Greenlaw, 92 speed, 90 Excel. Full pass coverage, he gets Lurk Artist. And I have silvers in there. It's actually for 25k, huge addition to the team. Justin Jefferson, Pat Sertan, Ray Lou. Lewis. Ray Lewis, Shannon Crowder, Jerry Rice. Okay, let's play ball. Doug Williams at quarterback. He's got that lighted up ability, dude. <laughs> You're asking for it. You're asking for it. All right, we're gonna have to cycle through defensive formations. What I have found when I'm using defenses that just aren't very meta. Ooh, Jalen Carter. Good thing I got those abilities back on. Sorry, what I found when I'm using defenses that aren't meta, my best option is really just to switch it up constantly so that my opponent can't exploit holes and, you know, spamming cover three or something. There's something about a Sam Will Blitz that's just such... Oh, it's so good. I'm so sad to not have it anymore. That's, that's sketchy! Darwin! Wait, I need the arts. Shit. I did turn around. Woo! Tell me why Derwin can really take this bag, though. I need the yards! That was, it was absolutely insane that I was able to get back to the 10 on that. Sketchy ball from Doug Williams. If this drive goes perfectly, it's 90 yards for Bryce Young. Let's hit, oh God. That was a fucking horrible ball! Oh, it was perfect accuracy, huh? Another perfect ball that's uncatchable. I didn't want to talk about it. Marshall Falk couldn't get to the ball. How could it be perfect accuracy? Fuck you. First and goal, that's a handoff. Oh my God, it's play action. What? Oh my God, he's dugging on me. That was disgusting. Holy shit, that just went from that just went from a miracle start to seven to zero, six to zero. That's what I get for trying to be fancy, I guess. Laporta, laser, huge. Damn, I missed set feet lead. Starting to realize how important that ability was. There's 26 yards out of our boy Bryce Young. I'm gonna go play action here. See if I can actually get him to bite. He does. Laporta again. Mm, what a catch. Okay, so it's the same throw. That time it goes through. I don't know. But Marshall Folk's gonna take that one. Hey, we got 53 yards now and we're moving. I'm staying in no huddle because we are bruising right now. Play action gets him. Laporta again. Ooh, pressure got to me that time. Nice play. I'm gonna try and run the ball left side. I can't fully telegraph the pass every time. Hey, we got Justin Jefferson too, right? Okay, we're hoping this is zone. It is. It's zone, Justin Jefferson. Beautiful, that's man coverage. It's not man coverage, but the whip's open anyway. So it doesn't matter. Second and five, 73 yards. He's leaving Justin Jefferson again? Are you out of your mind? Back on track, back on track. Actually, no, we're going, we're going beyond on track, baby. I'm going for two. Uh, what RPOs do I have? In Lions. Oh, we don't got shit. Okay, RPO alert bubble. RPO read bubble. We're going RPO read bubble for two. Yes, Laporta right in the middle. <gasps> Cut! Sam Laporta have my children. Did we get 90 passing yards on that? 95? Something really good. Absolutely do Holy shit. This guy is shifty. I got greedy though. I had the avalanche hit with Gronk. You know how it is. You know how it is. Second and nine. This is good defense right now. Let's cover the flat. He loves throwing that flat. Gronk, you take over here. Oh, I'm behind this. I'm behind this. I'm behind this. Fuck, not even the swoop! Deep zone KO! Avalanche Derwin James. Uh, uh, oh! Oh! Good defense. Good defense. I got a little scary. I got a little greedy though. I was going for the interception there. And I'm risking I'm risking getting mossed every time I do that. I, I think I just need to. He wants a corner route on 19. Yup. And then the dig, the dig, the dig. I'm here. I'm on it. Ba bag! <gasps> I am mad, but that is also 97 overall Justin Jefferson on 89 overall Brandon Stevens. So I can only be so mad. All right, let's blitz Dre Greenlaw. And I'll use Ray Lewis to cover this zone. Oh. He runs it again, doesn't matter, because 92 Bruce Smith, that was on guest pass, just dogged his lineman. He's got McCaffrey, does he see it? He sure does, no he doesn't! <gasps> the defense, Stevens! Fourth and 17, I gotta send a blitz. Let's go Mike Blitz, I haven't ran this play in a long time. Mike Blitz, baby, right up the gut. Ray Lewis, I know this from user linebacker. Superstar linebacker, I gotta get off! I gotta get there, shit! Locked his hat back, please. Good tackle. Fourth and long conversions from him on this one drive. He's got an RPO. He's got an RPO. This is an RPO, isn't it? It is. I think I'm fucking stupid. Oh, apparently I am, because I can't hit him. I knew what play it was. It's another RPO, Ray Lewis. Oh my God, he got a second animation. Ray Lewis had him stood up, and he got a second animation. Attempted to call a timeout. Yup. Yes! 
hit stick from Derwin that I recovered. And it's on the goal line. <laughs> that was a monster play. And guess what's even better about it, man? I'm on the two yard line. I am on the two yard line. So if I get this drive, it's a 98 yard drive. And we're going to start it out with a knockout. Oh, I was going to say we're going to start it out with a heater. Just got to just gotta be smart here. Jefferson. I'm not sure I'd call that being smart, but I finally have a little bit of breathing room. Got him. Check down. Money. Laporta. Oh, thank you. Wow, I got lit up. Laporta doesn't drop shit. Let's go, Laporta. The happiest man alive right now is Jamar Chase because his ass is about to get chewed out in film room. I'm going to eat his fucking ass. Let's take the easy one. Quentin Johnston, third and 10. Yeah, my offense is slowing down right now, though. Where's my sauce? Let's stay hot. Jamar Chase. Don't stop the tempo. 24 seconds. We're stat padding these yards and we're trying obviously to get in field goal range. Oh, Justin Jefferson press coverage. Let me do it. Ah, I'm gonna fucking do it anyway. Oh no, oh no, that's bad. I got greedy. I saw single coverage and my best wide receiver and I took it. Is that how it goes down in real life? <laughs> Felt like Nick Bosa had a little bit of extra motivation on that tackle. Mm, I wonder what it was. Would he tackle Mason Rudolph like that? He goes RPO. Does he go out of bounds with this or does he juke? Oh. Nine seconds, he gets to the 35. This has been a hell of a game. Luckily, that play took so long because he was in field goal range right there. If he throws that a second earlier and gets down faster, he gets the, t he gets the uh, he gets a field goal and he has the lead. Eight to seven, we get ball at half, which is huge. We also have a one point lead right now, a touchdown and a two point conversion. It's a two possession game. Uh, you know what I hate right now? I hate that he's giving me all these opportunities to throw seam beaters because it's so boring. What the fuck? That was the worst ball I've ever seen in my whole life. Bryce Young is so dog shit. Can we? Okay, we have to see that again. That was a throw to Sam Laporta. He threw it directly in the chest of the man six yards in front of Sam Laporta. At least that time the game told me it was a poor accuracy throw. At least that time they're willing to fucking admit it. God, Bryce Young sucks ass. Oh, I'm there. Yeah! Oh, the bait. It was immaculate. Oh! That was sick. That was sick. I bit down like I was going to fill on the running back, immediately peeled. Oh, that was beautiful. Tell me why Justin Jefferson can't beat his man, though. He has him, right? Yes. Oh, and that's a good accuracy pass. He can't even get the free form. Dude, Bryce Young is ass. Is this really what it's like, Panthers fans? I did not mean to keep that ball. Oh my God, it worked. It's certain inches, actually. It didn't, it technically worked, but not fully. That is so funny. That is not what I meant to do at all. That was a horrible ball by me. Five foot 10 QB sneak. <laughs> Jeez, this is hard. I'm so nervous. Well, no, I can throw this. Ow. Second and one, 147 yards. I don't think we're gonna get the challenge wheel, but definitely have a good opportunity to win the ball game. Oh, Laporta. What a ball! There we go, Bryce Young! There we go, Bryce Young! I'm gonna go Jamar Chase on a uh, on a hitch here. Yep. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, no, I don't think I can get him. I don't even think Big Trent can. Ah, you're gonna show, though? You just lost now. Oh, you're getting handed this game because Bryce Young is shit. You see, so shit. This is also why I need set feet lead, though. Set feet lead gives you extra velocity on those bullet passes, and I don't have it anymore. He's gonna go for two here. I assume he passes this. He does. He's bagged. Fucking bagged. Huge, 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 huge. Nick Bosa, another big play. Got a five-point lead. Or sorry, five-point deficit. He goes onside kick. Uh, just let him touch it. It's a penalty. What the fuck? Oh my god, I can't wait to watch that back. Holy shit, can we watch that back? Justin Jefferson has him cooked! And then he stuttered and wobbled. Oh, when I pressed X on that ball, it was a touchdown. Like, actually, what the fuck is going on right now? This is insane. Okay. It's a hell of a juke. I'm not gonna lie. That's a pretty sick juke. And it keeps him in bounds. He basically has two defensive touchdowns right now. He had one that put him on the five and one pick six. He has, he has not gotten in the end zone yet. I mean, obviously he has, but you get what I'm saying. And he breaks that tackle. Oh my God, I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna puke. I hate how, how Justin Jefferson had him torched and then he did a fucking wobble step and lost all his speed. Nice juke. 
Hey, for, for all that I'm saying, this guy has great, um, he's got the best jukes I've seen in a while. Ooh. Ooh. Turn over. <laughs> that is three interceptions for Derwin James. I have eight points to show for it. I hate you, Bryce Young. And I hate me for playing like shit. I, like, sh sh should I just stop looking at Justin Jefferson entirely? Dude is cooking everyone and managing to not come up with the ball. See, okay, so that one I can admit. Like, he's not cooked. Jefferson will be open here because he's running the same shit. Huge. Third and inches. Now he's going to press down. And I can hit Jefferson on this underneath. Got him. What the fuck are you doing, Bryce? Oh my god. I snapped that ball and threw it, and he didn't throw it. It's five interceptions. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> We're gonna win this game. There's Marshall Folk right in the middle. Using our clock very efficiently. Second one, that's exactly what I want right there. So I don't have to pick up the first down, because it should be a very free first down. I should just be able to get this kind of whenever I want. Easy check down to... Uh, I think you know what I could do? I could go a single back with one wide receiver on the left. I could give him a drag, and I could throw the drag. There it is. God, I'm good. I'm so happy. Like, there might be a touchdown here, but I don't really want it. I don't want to get sacked either, but I guess that keeps the clock running. He's not going to call a timeout. Wow, you just want to let it run? I think Sam Laporta might have it right here, right now. He's going to take the underneath. Oh shit, I didn't want that. Third and 23. Gigantic play. There's Jamar Chase. Caught. Fourth and eight, six seconds left. Ball game right here. This is the ball game right here. I like the Sam Laporta. I really do. I'm gonna block Marshall Falk. I'm looking at Sam. Fourth and eight. Let's go. I don't know. I just trusted Quentin Johnson with the game on the line. I just trusted Quentin Johnson with the game Let's on the line. Let's go. <laughs> I hate Bryce Young so fucking much. I should have started a silver player. He would have thrown better balls than that fucking bum. Bryce Young is so dog shit, it's Im it's unimaginable. Yeah, I could have played a better game, but honestly, holy shit, the amount of times Bryce Young just fucking fumbled that game is insane. All right, we got to watch that final play, though. Was anybody open here? You don't have my fourth and nine play on replay? All right, boys, we fall to 0-1. We can't keep any of our players from those wheel spins. We do get to keep our impeccable box. We get to keep our rage quit Dre Greenlaw. So what's the good news here? The good news, we get to keep Justin Jefferson. We get to keep Sam Laporta. We get to keep Dre Greenlaw. Everybody else has to go. Huh, frustrating wheel of mutt. But um, can't really let that ruin my mood. This is such a sick, sick episode. And hopefully we can get redemption in the next one. Nobody can take my Sam Laporta away from me. All right, boys, I love you. Thanks for watching as always. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.